He said, I'm about to go out to lunch with them, daddy. I'll be right back. Is it cool if I go? I told her, yeah, I'm hurry up and come back because I'm, I'm taking you all later. She told me, okay, I love you. I'll see you when I get back. Nyla never made it back home. I was around the corner, heard the accident, and then I knew it was her. Corone Law robbed of his six-year-old daughter. My heart fell out of my stomach. Didn't want to believe it. Still don't want to believe it. Balloons mark the spot on Detroit's west side where Nyla was killed Monday. Detroit police say a speeding driver in a truck likely ignored the red light at Plymouth and the Southfield service drive smashing into the caravan Nyla was in with her aunt and two cousins. The driver of the truck disoriented at the scene was arrested and remains in custody. Furious is an understatement, you know. My emotions that I'm feeling right now, there's no words for it. My baby was snatched from me. Nyla's aunt, Elizabeth Harris, just woke from a coma and is still in critical condition. She's known on the city's west side for her restaurant, Baby Back's Open Pit. She feeds the community. She's great to the community. They love her. Uh, matter of fact, her nickname is Liz Love because everybody loves her, and that's exactly what she put into her food, love. Oh, yeah, we got macaroni and yams, cornbread, all the good stuff. All the you good stuff. You just don't have stuff. enough room to put it out. The guy who hit her took all of that away from her. People, please slow down and be careful out here so don't nobody else have to feel this pain. A family shattered, praying Elizabeth pulls through as they prepare to bury little Nyla. She loved everybody. And she, she just wanted to see everybody happy. And you know we out here every day with it. I'ma show you how to get it. It go right foot up, left foot slide. Close family friend is State Representative Latanya Garrett. She set up a GoFundMe page to cover funeral costs and pay for Elizabeth's long recovery. If you want to donate, head to Fox2Detroit.com. Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News.